of redemption for this guy. Six in the world in Saitama. But uh, didn't make the Olympic team. Runner up in Moscow four years ago, well, four seasons ago. 25 years of age now. Should be in his prime. Let's hope he is right here. Takahiko Kozuka for Japan starts this second group. Off the free leg went down. Yeah, I, I hope he made the rotation. He did touch down with the free leg. The key thing is, was it fully rotated? Looked like it could be a bit short. Now for the axle. Yes. Special triple axle from Kazuka. Yeah, this is much more like it. The triple looks triple toe. Both elements look poor. Yeah, always something, isn't it? What a shame. interpretation of the music such a pleasing character to watch and he brings a smile to your face pleasing personality a lovely skater it was virtually flawless the combination though will hurt and maybe the toe loop at the start yeah that could be very costly errors if he was under rotated on those it's uh, really, really going to hurt. That technical score is not going to be pretty at all. But it was better than Skate Canada. Absolutely. Up until that combination, I thought, we're looking like the Kazuka of old. But then that lack of confidence crept in towards the end of the program. That is mighty close. Let's have a look in slow motion. Does he make four turns? It's right in that last quarter. Marginal. Think, yeah. I think he'll get it. He won't get a downgrade, but he'll get an under rotation for it. Axel was an absolute cracker. Here's the Lutz. Didn't get a lot of height on that. You can see double footed landing. Does a turn. Brave enough to go for triple toe on the end of that. That is definitely short. So here you see this one. At that speed, you can't see it, but uh, both jumps landed on two feet and under rotated. 
plus that turn in the middle. It's uh, it's not going to be pretty. Second mark should be high. Oh, I hope so. But of course, those mistakes do get reflected in that second mark as well. Yes. So it's not going to be as high as it would have done. But perhaps he's on the road back. There were glimmers of light in that performance, yes. weren't there? He looked more confident. Number Sato, who trains him in Nagoya, along with his daughter Yuka, former world champion. Well, he's in great hands, you know, it's uh, all you can do when, when a skater loses their confidence is just be patient and work through it. And uh, if you can hang on in there nine times out of ten, things start getting better. Michigan leads, but not now. Kazuka moves in front, they liked it. Despite the flaws, the judges had him in front. Technically very good. Presentation mark, well, rightly high. He leads by a couple of marks.